Alrighty. Hello, everyone. I am Katana, the lightning cat. I decided to sleep in my own freaking bed instead of on my couch. Give me a minute while I take a weed. <coughs> no, I'm not going to show you. Say hello to everybody. Say good night, Tracy. <coughs> oh, this looks diabolical, doesn't it? <laughs> Yeah, I know. Food. Give me a moment. I gotta turn on the light so I can see to actually give it to you. Just hang on a bit. There we go. Cats have food. <clears throat> oh my gosh. I can't believe you've done that. For frag snacks. Fucking god damn it, mother bitch fucking <sighs> One of the cats decided to tear up the blinds. Fuck's sake. <coughs> <coughs> bitch queen from hell. You deserve to be called that. You know that? You tore up everything. Yeah, you. You. Bitch queen from hell. She tore up everything. <clears throat> Fuck's sake, man. You're a fucking pain in the ass to deal with, you know that? Huh? Yeah, do you know that? Yeah, try to look all cute. You're not fooling me. 
You turned into the bitch queen from hell and tore my blinds up. <coughs> and that was after you tore up all my paper. Crazy frickin' cat. Crazy cat. Crazy cat. What the fuck is wrong with you? <clears throat> what the hell's your problem, huh? Would you end answering me that? What is your problem? Why do you tear every fucking thing up? Why does this cat tear up everything? <coughs> Why? Turning on all this stuff to do a thing. Here, sit right there for a moment. Chair. And I must turn on the warmth. Keep some warmth going at night. That way I've got something, you know? Crazy cat, crazy cat. What the hell is wrong with you? Crazy cat, crazy cat, paper taste bad. So the reason you're getting two wake up vlogs today is because I went to sleep at around blah 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 a.m. and I woke up at uh, freaking 8 p.m. I needed to rest again. I really did. Sleeping on the couch was giving me a crick in my neck which was causing a pain in my brain. <coughs> which was stopping my fame in the game. Oi! So, because I'm using slims, which are actually longer for rolling, I'm using a longer straw and I tape together these two pen cartridges. They're quite empty, mind you. Oh, wait, I fucked that up. <clears throat> Oi, I'm sure I typed in the right code. Store page. How can you tell me Chrome didn't shut down properly when I shut it down myself and exited?
Oh yeah. My dick sword is saying Leroy Jenkins. That's funny. I like those little quips that they put in the Discord when it loads up. That's nice. <clears throat> <clears throat> So anyway, <clears throat> I saw a YouTube video where this dude was telling everyone about uh, music companies and, and industry just claiming, just blanket claiming everyone's video, even if it was a parody made with custom in instrumentals, or if they were just fucking doing like a few seconds worth of the song. I mean, fair use, motherfuckers. Do you fucking know what that goddamn means? It means we can use a clip of it for the fuck's sake funsies. Or we can use the whole damn thing for an analytical fucking breakdown. Mind you, I'm not going to do an analytical breakdown. But, you know, I'll, I'll use like Eventually, I'll be using like a little clip just for the fuck's sake funsies of providing comedic impact to a thing. Like womp womp womp. Because, you know, you, you're fucking everyone over. Also, I had a dream of talking dogs. Three talking dogs, and then one regular dog that was afraid of them, and then they made that dog throw up. I don't know why. <coughs> Go figure. It's crazy. It is crazy. But then again, I'm insane, so my dreams should not make sense to you. Not in the least. <clears throat> also, Batman was in it. Go figure that one out. Talking dogs and Batman. It's beginning to sound a lot like that episode where Lex Luthor made this nanobot version of all of the heroes, including, what was it, Green Lantern... What's her name? From the Amazons. Wonder Woman. <coughs> the Flash. Um, the Martian. Superman. Hawk Girl. Or should I say Hawk Woman? I really don't like the fact that you say hot girl when she's not a girl. She's a full-fledged fucking woman. She's strong, independent hawk woman who don't need no hawk man. I pity the fool. I pity the fool. That's right, Balto. You take off because I'm acting crazy. Just wants to sit in my lap for warmth. So anyway, yeah, um, anybody remember when Trump said the level of violence on gaming? Yeah, that was a small stab to distract everybody from what he was really doing, which was taxing the living fuck out of the gaming industry. That's why they're, well, one of the reasons why they're rushing shit out to get money. <coughs> They're being taxed on top of the additional taxes they have to pay, which is why they're passing on the taxes to us. That's why Microsoft, um, a year worth of Microsoft time on your Xbox Live Gold membership went up to $60. 
that's why the the transactions in the Microsoft store had tax put on them that was a few months ago that was like six months ago does anybody remember that I do. <clears throat> so the thing here is how do we support the gaming industry which is being uh, politically assassinated by Trump's actions? My thing is hey everybody in the gaming industry if you really want that much money <clears throat> and yeah I know you need a lot of funding because Trump's being a little bitch to the whole gaming industry and um, political assassination you know it's not my bag right now because I'm not the dragon I used to be once I get my me back and I turn into a full-fledged fucking dragon I'm going to fucking burn half of the United States out of existence just because of how pissed off I am. I'm going to record it and I'm going to upload it to my YouTube channel. <clears throat> and I'm going to control all of you fuckers through fear. Making you do whatever the fuck I want. It's called terrorism. Get the fuck over it. I don't care anymore. Like I told that guy in prison, give me 15 years, give or take a few months here. And I'm not talking about Dragon as in the highest tier of the fucking Ku Klux Klan. I hate those fucking ass shits. You know what's even more fucked up? <clears throat> In my family lineage, I have fucking connection to those assholes. I briefly thought about using that connection to infiltrate them and then assassinate them all. Briefly. I decided against it because I don't want to have any fucking connection to them, family or non. <coughs> also, I decided against it because I'm Apache, Blackfoot, and Cherokee. Fuck white supremacy. This land is mine. This entire fucking continent. And if I want to, when I turn into a dragon, I will burn the entire fucking thing into it's a sheet of fucking glass. I just don't give a fuck what any of you think anymore. Keep your fucking lame ass opinions to yourself because opinions are like shit. You Americans are full of it. You don't like it? I don't give a fuck. But anyway, Trump's little hit piece on gaming. <clears throat> gaming industry idiots. If you're really hurting for cash that much, start a PayPal, a patron, or a GoFundMe, okay? Crowdfund your games like indie developers. There's three flavors of crowdfunding you can use right there. Also, all of you in the industry take this advice and I'm saying this because I give a fuck <coughs> for gaming not for your lives <clears throat> set yourself up a brokerage account in the in whatever brokerage firm you like cram a few hundred thousand dollars in it so that you can live off the interest and um, that way you can take less money to do your job so that when your company says they need to cut back on things you can be the first to step up and say well in your mind you can say hey I've got a brokerage account and I'm earning a decent amount of interest even after paying taxes which you're gonna have to pay a maximum of 30 percent for federal income on it you can step up and say, hey, I'll take a pay cut. 
That way, you'll have that nice cushion in your brokerage account to fall back on. Don't ever take any out of it unless it's off the interest that it earns. Now, I've been told three separate things from three separate guys when talking to uh, representatives from my brokerage firm. The first dude told me I would get monthly amount of 0.001%. Next guy told me it was uh, annual 0.001%. And then the third guy told me it was annual of 0.003 that was divided out over the months but it was still an annual percent yield. So quite honestly, cram a metric fuck ton of cash into it and then calculate what percentage you're getting based off of the monthly payout. Hell, I don't know. <coughs> After getting three separate types of information, fuck it, who cares? Just calculate what you're getting on your own. That should help a little. Yeah. Get your own fucking brokerage account. Get your fucking uh, crowdfunding going for your... Uh, games. That way this Fallout 76, this No Man's Sky, this fucking Battlefield 5 shit doesn't happen. And hey, assholes sitting there in the board of directors. You don't control gaming. We do. The people who buy the fucking games. Without us, you don't get any fucking money, you fucking idiots. <coughs> <coughs> also, take my fucking advice. Set yourself up a goddamn brokerage. Cram a few million into it and live off the fucking interest. No, no. Five million should be enough for you greedy motherfuckers. Cover all your baselines. That way, you can sell all your shares in the gaming industry to me. So I can do a nice hostile buyout and run things my fucking way. It's so cold, it's putting out my flame. Oh yeah, another thing. Uh, one video from the YouTube channel Extra Credits said that gaming was an art. That's that's an outright fucking lie. Gaming is a product and a service to everyone's unalienable right to the pursuit of happiness. And the entire industry is guilty of violating everyone's pursuit of happiness. <clears throat> I've said it before when I was giving advice and feedback. Get the frick off my Xbox console, cat! Psst! Psst! No! Yeah, I know you're a young little kitten, but you gotta learn fast. What the fuck? I typed in the, the web address. Why didn't you go to it? Anyway. <clears throat> so all these news fuckers, all these fake media bitches, they're doing this stupid hit piece nonsense on pubes again, trying to distract from the real issues. got you assholes running in circles. All the social justice faggots, all the feminazi morons. 
Here's another piece of advice, everybody. Look up something on YouTube called The History of Your Enslavement. There's this little bit in it where it says, get everyone riled up chasing each other around, fighting each other, distracted from what you're doing, and your enslavement is complete. And then it, run, it, it runs through all the fucking models of enslavement. Now you've just got enslavement with the hint of freedom that you're chasing. You think you're free, but you're not. You're just doing what the fuck the assholes in charge want you to do, which is being a little bitch to everybody around you. Social justice faggots, feminazis, trolls, morons, all of you. Stupid fucking retarded idiots. <clears throat> if I didn't give a fuck, I wouldn't be saying anything. But it's kind of my fucking job to give a fuck. For now, anyway. <clears throat> Seriously, damn. You know, I think I've ranted long enough. <clears throat> I am severely pissed off at how fucking stupid everyone is. At how fucking moronic and incompetent everyone is being. And it's only getting worse. I've watched for... 15 years... I've watched the decline of quality of gaming. Games are coming out unfinished. And it's becoming more and more acceptable because all the little fucking idiots, yeah, you, you fucking eight year old morons with mommy and daddy's credit card going, Buy me, buy me, oh, it's shiny, oh, I like the commercial, buy me. Seriously, you need to grow the fuck up. You're too stupid, ignorant, dumb, moronic, and naive to know what the fuck's going on. So you just need to shut the fuck up. <clears throat> I'm ending this right here. Feel free to fuck off and come back later. And for those of you who actually like this, this satire, this really pissed off satire... Which, um, satire may be used for comedic purposes, but it's basically a parody of real life events. See South Park for further details. And remember, Trey and Matt are satiring and parodying real life. That's why I actually have a, a, a degree, a small degree of respect for them. <coughs> <coughs> Till next time, everybody. Bye. And don't forget, for those of you who enjoy this ranting shit, there's support links in the description for PayPal, Patreon, and GoFundMe. Or as I like to call it, GoFuckMe. So feel free to tell me, shut up and take my money!